Hello guys, welcome to Cloud Tech. So today we are going to look at some of the Java 8 programs that were asked in uh, Capgemini and TCS. So this is for a beginner level Java learners for one to two years of experience. So let's get onto the uh, program. So this program was asked in Capgemini in TCS and this was a practical program. So the program is given an input. The input is one, two, three, four, and five. We have to find squares of all the numbers and we have to print them. So let's go to the Eclipse editor and try to solve this. Uh, the first thing that I'll do is create a list of integer because uh, the representation that was shown in the problem was a list of integer one, two, three, four, five. So uh, let me create uh, a list and list I'll try to import it from java.util. Uh, this is going to be of type integer and I'm going to name uh, this variable as numbers equal to now i'm going to add elements and initialize the list so to do that i'm going to use arrays dot as list so this takes um integers and create those uh, elements into the list so i'll add one two three four and five uh, the problem statement is we need to find all the even numbers the even numbers are the ones which are divisible by two so there are two even number, uh, one is two and the other one is four. So the final output, uh, the final list should contain these two elements, uh, two and four. Uh, so let's try to solve this. To solve this, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take help of Java 8. So to solve this, I'm going to take, I'm going to call numbers dot stream. The first thing that you do in Java 8 uh, is you use stream. But to get the stream, uh, there's a method dot stream after uh, after we got the stream uh, we are going to filter and find only the even numbers and the even numbers are the ones which are divisible by two so i'm going to write n and any number uh, modulus two and if the remainder is zero that means it is the even number now once i get the uh, even number i'm going to find the square of it how to find the square of it i'm going to use the map function a map is uh, the function if you want to transform any element into some other form for example here we are transforming n into n square in that case we use map so uh, let's give uh, the element as n and given n we want n square which is n into n now we got the n square the final step is to collect the result into another list so let's use uh, collect and we want to collect the result in a list. So that is the reason we are going to specify <coughs> collectors dot to list. The to list will ensure that the final result comes into a list. Now, as we know, the result is going to be in the list. So I'm going to make a list of uh, integer and I'm going to name this list as uh, even numbers. So let me uh, format this control A, uh, control shift f in eclipse you can use another editor and find the shortcut now i'll do uh, switch out which is printing and i'll try to uh, print the even numbers so that's all uh, now i'll try to run this and uh, save and run you can see i got the square of even number i got the square of 2 which is 4 and then i got the square of 4 which is 16 uh, just to uh, ensure everyone understands, uh, we have to take stream, we have to filter and find the even numbers. And then we need to square each number uh, after filtering using the map method. And finally, we have to collect the result <laughs> using collectors.to list. It will be a new list. And then you have to print the even numbers. So uh, that, that is the answer of the first question. Now, uh, let's move to the next question. So this was al also asked to two years experience, Capgemini and uh, TCS. Here, what we have to do, we have to find all the even numbers and then we have to take the sum of it. So let's take an example. <coughs> Here we have one, two, three, four, and five. Then we find uh, the even numbers, which is two and four. And then we take sum of it. So here you can see the sum is 20. Now, uh, the second input where uh, there are three elements, one, two, and three, we find the even number which is 2 and <laughs> we take sum of it. <coughs> so there is no other element and hence the sum is 4. So let's uh, try to solve this practically. Mm, I have written, I have already created a class. 
sum of even square a year also uh, will take uh, will create an a list so i'm going to copy the same list from the previous example uh, this is the list which we are going to use now what we have to do we have to identify uh, the first step remains the same we have to identify the even numbers so uh, let me uh, do numbers dot stream we got the stream now filter filter is where we identify the even numbers uh, n is n modulus 2 equal to equal to 0 uh, this will filter out only the even numbers. We'll get only the even numbers after this step. Now, the next is we need to get the square of each number. So whenever we want to transform or uh, any element, we use map. So n into n. We transform n into n square. <clears throat> and finally, we want uh, uh, at this step, uh, there is one thing we need to do map to int. Rather than just mapping, we need to do map to end because we want sum of it. And finally, we take sum. And sum will give us uh, the actual sum. Uh, let's capture this into integer. And I'll name this as sum. After this, I'll try to print out. Uh, sum is and the actual value of uh, the variable, which is sum. Uh, let's try to uh, save this. I'll save this. And given the input 2 and 4, so 2 square plus 4 square, which is 20. So let's run this program. <coughs> so the sum is 20. Now what I'll do, I'll add one more uh, 5 and 6. So I added one more element. Uh, let's save this and let's run this. So it gives uh, the sum is 56. Great. So let, let me remove some elements. Uh, so I'll keep only 1 and 2. So there's only one even number, which is, which is this uh, 2. And hence the result should be four. So let me run this program. Save. Yeah, so we got the answer. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, thank you guys for watching and keep watching, keep subscribing, and keep liking the video.